is Izzy. If, oh, you, yeah. if you were on the show, right? Uh -huh. You're Izzy. You know, I don't care. You're Hannah. But yeah. you come on the show as a Survivor super fan is what I'm trying to say. Uh -huh. You immediately identify. I know that this is Sari. This is Jared. This is her son. I know all the seasons that she's played on. I watched all of them. Oh, yeah. How would you hold that move? Or that power? I love that question because I one of my favorite things about watching Big Brother is just thinking through the different game scenarios and what you would choose and what you would say if you were in that um, predicament. But A, Izzy just did that so hastily. They hadn't even set their towels down from being outside. And she just came, she blurted it out. And she didn't even try to be quiet. Like, it, it's very possible no. that someone else could have been within earshot. It doesn't seem like anyone else was, but she just wasn't careful. She was sloppy with it. Um, I would not have done that. I would have made the connection. And if Jared were on the block, then I would have definitely waited to see who won HOH because you don't know who's going to hold the power. And if I ended up winning HOH or a close ally of mine ended up winning HOH, I think I would kind of observe how Sari and Jared are interacting, how they're integrating themselves within the house. And if I feel like, okay, I can leverage this information to gain me more social capital because these two are kind of like controlling what's happening, then I would go up to them. Um, also, if they were on the fringes, then I would leverage that information to pull them in and kind of build like an army of my own. Because Jared was on the block, he was in a vulnerable position. And so he he wasn't in the position where he could say like, okay, so-and-so has to go home because he was in jeopardy of going home. But if Jared were not on the block, I would not, I would take my time. Even if I waited like a week, a week and a half, I would also like want to know who else has observed the same thing as me. I would listen for rumblings. I think the trick is just to listen and wait and be very meticulous. So that's what I would have done. 